Welcome back. Now, it should be obvious what we're actually going to be doing here. It was obvious that Zin's going to have some more dialogue. There's going to be something going on with Kilika ahead of us. So I want to know, is there any, like, important scenes or anything like that that are significant in the fights that are currently happening? That I should swap out characters? It's like, I'll still go through them with my normal characters, like with Olivia and stuff like that. But then I'll revisit with the important ones, so like Zin here, definitely going to be important with Kilika. Obviously. I know I need to go back to the, um, what was it? Monochrome Schoolhouse, that was it, wasn't it? With Agat, so I can get some more stuff there with him. So I'm just wondering if there's more like that. Please do let me know if there's any, like, really significant ones that I need to go see, that I could, story-wise, that it'll be important. So, let's progress with Zin. Got hiccups at that point, it's not really a good idea to have hiccups at that point. I'll skip out the fight. Because we've seen that. You certainly took your time. Uh-oh. <sighs> I hit the nail on the head this time. I shouldn't be mentioned it, then. Leaving that oath over there aside for the time being, it's good to see you again, Annalise. I hope you've been doing well since I left. <laughs> I have, thanks. Damn, talk about harsh. I've got a name, you know. Can you not spare a word of greeting for me, too? I see you all the time in Calvert, as it is. It hasn't even been that long since we last met. Or were you hoping this would be a moving reunion? But I divided into your... Divid. Yep. Dived into your arms with tears in my eyes. I'm good, thanks. Now, right down to business, Kevin. I take you to understand the situation without me needing to explain it. I think so. I assume you're the second guardian, Philip Wells being the first. We'll need to defeat you in order to advance to the next area. Correct. I can't say I'm fond of having to fight in an old Ouroboros space of all things. Oh well, I suppose it will have to do this time. Those are Shakrams. Watch out, guys. Those are really deadly as throwing weapons. It's been a few years since we last had the joy of battling one another's in. I have no intention of holding back this time, which means I'll be using my Shakrams against you. I wouldn't have it any other way. With one of those, you were stronger than even Walter, so I'd love to see how I fare against you these days. Show us all what the Flying Swallow can do. Gladly. As the second guardian, I, Kiliko Rudin, Master Level, student of the Taito School, will serve as your opponent. To arms. Let's do this. I'll give this all I've got. Yeah. I should have known that wouldn't go quite like our fights always used to. You've refined your skills beautifully over the years. I could say the same to you. It's hard to believe you were spending the time serving as a guild receptionist instead of doing some kind of intensive training. There's no need to flatter me. My skills still need plenty of refining if I want to reach the heights of the Taito School. But if my real self remembers this defeat, I'm quite sure she's going to be frustrated enough to want to get back to training. Be certain you're all ready, you're all ready to serve as her opponent when she does, Zin. You got it. Although if you ask me, I think you're strong enough as you are. You're telling me. I'd be scared out of my wits to fight you again if I ever reach the heights of the Taito School, personally. I'm astounded by how well you were able to use your chi in battle. Well, the time to say our goodbyes has come. From my defeat, you're now halfway through the trials of the Sixth Plane. Just be sure not to let your guards down. I'm sure the greatest challenges are very much still to come. Farewell. Let us meet again one day. Man, she's never been one to hold back. It's hard to believe that wasn't even the real Kilika. Anyway, we should be able to enter the next area now. Don't know about you guys, but I'm exhausted. Let's say we go back to the guard before we keep going. That sounds wise to me. 
And it was also mentioned down in the comments that someone wanted to see my reaction to when Ren is here and you try to activate this monument here. So let's have a look. The face of the monument is glowing and words are visible upon its surface. The Lord of Phantasma does decree. Here lies the impregnable fortress. Place your hand on the monument. The Divine Blade Successor among your number. Great. I don't have a clue what impregnable fortress could be referring to. But I think we all know who we're going to need to have with us this time. Yep. No one else but Richard fits that description. I have to see we're on the same page. Let's head back to the garden and ask him to come with us. Hmm. <laughs> with him, we'll have a regular onion and a spring onion in the same party. And what did I do to deserve that cruel observation of my awesome hair? I don't even style my hair like this on purpose, you know? It just whoops up this way, naturally. Oh, really? I wonder if the same can be said of the Colonel. <laughs> yeah, it was worth it. I almost thought you guys weren't going to show up. Huh? What? What? You guys look like you just seen a ghost or something. <laughs> That surprised to see us here, huh? Who are you guys? I've never even seen you before. They're part of the Ravens, a gang that used to hang around over in Ruan, the port city. They recently passed the exam to become junior braces, though. Hey, how are you guys doing here? Hm, damned if we know. All of a sudden we just... were. Wait, are you implying... Well, not... we're not real, by the looks of it. We're just imitations of our real selves created by someone or something to do battle with you. That's all we're here for. So you're copies of real people created here like Celeste then. Or the one like her, it was the Lord of Phantasma that created you. Maybe. And if that's the case, you're not going to let us go without a fight, huh? I can't say I've got anything against you guys, but fighting you is what we're here for, so yeah. And if we can't go against it, might as well enjoy it. Time to pay you back for working us to the bone, I get. Hmm. Show me what you've got. If we have no choice, then let's fight with all we have. <sighs> Help but wonder how we of all folks ended up being created here to fight you. Guess this is just fate or something. Just don't even think of holding back. Commanders of all you've got. To arms. Show me what you guys got. Crud. You, you got us good. Huh. Looks like we're gonna have to get a hell of a lot stronger if we wanna rank up to being senior braces. Hey, there's no need to be hard on yourselves. Put up a damn good fight. I agree, you did very well. Remember what I said after your exam. You've got the strength. How far you can go after this is just a matter of experience. Make sure you put as much into your bracer work as you did into that battle. Can't resist a chance to act like our teacher, can you? Either way, looks like our role in this world is over now. We've got no way of telling if our real selves are gonna be aware of what happened here. But well, if you run into us in the real world again, say hi, okay? Don't get cocky because you won, though. The guy waiting up ahead is nastier than we could dream of. You're not gonna stand a chance if you don't give it everything you've got. What's it gonna be, fill it with two L's? I doubt it. They just... vanished. <laughs> Hang around just long enough to say their piece and then off they go. <laughs> I look forward to seeing what kind of braces they become. Anyone else feel like the purple-haired guy's parting words were on the ominous side? We're heading towards the old schoolhouse, right? That's right. It's a stone building that was used by the academy until a few decades ago. It's no longer in use these days. Not sure why Rocker was referring to it, but... Sounds like we should make sure we're ready before going inside. Right, so I feel there were significant scenes in regards to those characters. And that's the kind of thing I'm after, so if there's any more like that, please do let me know. I'll go back and re-record stuff all over the place in order so we can get those kind of scenes. So anyway, let's carry on with the actual story. The Lord of Phantasma does decree. Here lies the impregnable fortress. Place your hand on this monument. The Divine Blade successor among your number. Triple dot. Touch the monument. Now 
of that riddle makes sense. What better place to describe as an impregnable fortress than this? Probably somewhere with some railway cannons, but alright. As referred to as the fortress, you know. I mean, what what could go on there? Anything bad? No. A good old Lyston Fortress, huh? You can already tell we're going to get a real fun welcome. <laughs> well, aren't we in for a treat? I think it's safe to say that whoever is waiting for us, and I can think of a few who may be, uh, we're going to need to give the battles our all. This isn't an area we can conquer with anything less than top form. This is just cheating. What an interesting development. Thanks for your input, Olivia. <laughs> it's just like, alright, oh, hey, you're there, saying things. Now, I was hoping I could turn the camera and maybe see like a chest or something. Nope. I mean, I'd hide a chest there. It's a perfect spot to hide a chest. Ugh. This wall. It's like, just, just wall. Doggy! I'm caught with a doggy then. Attack Doberman. A monster trained to attack quickly corners intruders with its superior speed and sharp fangs. Alright then, um... I mean, hmm, this is a question though. Because of Vanish, will that actually vanish them? Because it doesn't do damage, but it pulls them in, so... Okay, no. I, th I think that was a worthwhile experiment there, just to see how, how that would react with the higher elements, etc. Um, etc. and stuff. I mean, obviously we've got to go with it. Spam, haven't we? Now, regardless. I'm trying to focus on getting more speed for him as well. Like, e everything to try and push it so he like gets that attack. Again and again and again and again and again. You know, using a similar tactic I did with Muse. Only here it feels more fun. I don't know how to describe it. Who puts a chest here? Master beads. No, you can't return it. You don't even have the receipt. But I do! It's right here! What? Just want to make sure we get the chests out here first. They're going to be in the middle of the field, you know. There's a lovely chest. Bop, bop. Bop, bop. Wait. That sounds like... Everyone spread out! Uh-oh. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Yeah, we don't stand a chance. Indeed, we have nothing to gain by staying here any longer. Retreat. Well, that's cool. I like that. It's not a simple of case of like, ah, oh, jump up and defeat. It's like, no, get out of here. We need to do other things first. Like, cool. Ah, uh, uh, oh, what are we even supposed to do against that? I thought we were done for. That was certainly a heart-pounding experience that I'd rather not go through again. I doubt we're meant to do anything against it. It's more likely to serve as a warning that we shouldn't go this way for now. How about we investigate elsewhere instead? Works for me. As long as we're alive, there's always a chance we'll be able to get through here later. I like that, because that's, that's, it's, it sort of feels like a story way of blocking you from progressing certain ways. The door is locked. Isn't it always? I want to check back to the other room, really. Do, 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 do. The door is locked. Yeah, you just gotta be sure the door is locked. You know, security and that. You, you always double check your doors. You know. There's a guard here this time. Well, that changes things. Let's go with True Luminous Ogre Slash. It should be obvious what I'm gonna do with him constantly now, isn't it? And I found the tactic. People, people, like, nudge me towards that tactic, but... I was messing around as well, and it's sort of like, ah, I combine that with that, done. And then, that's what happens, you know. It's that case, like, people are like, Richard's really good, you should use him. I was like, why? Why is Richard good? Now I see. 
Why is he so good? I wouldn't even say he's good, he's broken. Very broken. I suppose this is where I should welcome you all. Lieutenant Colonel Sid. Oh, sorry, I'm British. Lieutenant Colonel Sid. So you're our first opponent. Lieutenant, so stupid. It seems like you've been through quite a lot since last we met, Father Graham. I certainly hadn't expected this was what was going to happen back when we met in Gransel. All of this still feels like a bad dream to me, too, to be honest. Remember all that happened under Gransel Cathedral, then? I do. I can't be sure exactly when the me that stands before you was created here, but I can say it must have been after that if my memories are anything to go by. Hmm. It's good to see you again, too, Richard. This was hardly how I envisioned our reunion going, but it's good to be able to have one all the same. I could say the same to you. That being said, I wasn't expecting a soldier as formidable as you to be our first opponent. This bodes poorly for us. <laughs> Don't count yourselves out just yet. Even if I have no intention of being defeated. What? Blah. We're surrounded. On my honor as former garrison commander of Lyston Fortress, I, Lieutenant Colonel Maximilian Sid, will defeat you. Oh, will you now? We'll see about that, won't we, mate? Because, boom. I mean, just, just put it on Sid. Like, obviously, come in here. Requiem for a doomed opponent. Requiem for a doomed opponent. Take that! And there's Napalm! Hmm, quite formidable. Honestly, like using S-Crafts to test things out. That makes sense. Like, just to see how things are going, how things are, and... What's the best way to approach things? It just has that feeling to it of like... It's a good way to gauge your enemy. Alright, put that on him. Oh crap. That needs resolved. They need some noises like... Hup, 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 hup. Hup, 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 hup. Okay, right, okay, okay, okay. Um, hmm. I've got to go with True Luminous Wheel, haven't I, really? It's, it's sensible. Be gone. You know the noise. Let's get that going as well. I think it's probably safer. May its holiest of lights act as our shield. Alright, true luminous over slash. I don't do it once, obviously. Let people know what I'm doing when they. Some people like to listen to these videos rather than watch them, so it's like so they know at least what I'm doing when they hear the slash noise. Hmm? What was that? Oh, very well. How about you? <laughs> Paint round. I thought you were doing that on Sid then. I was like, what are you doing? It's like, mate, that's, you, that's your own guy. You shouldn't do that. Um, I kind of need to get you out of that situation, don't I, Olivia? But... This is this is too fun. Seems like they're just doing that. 
All right, let's 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 just solve your issue there. It's a crit speed up, that means it's got like 75% speed, doesn't it? Yes, yes, yes. Hmm. You're done? Who needs a clock up? You need a clock up. Let's go back to normal attacks for you now. I want to see his S-Craft. I mean, I've seen it, but I want it on a video. So it's a case of, like... Kinda wanna get that sorted. Now, so I need to build up his CP so we can actually do that. <laughs> Let's go with... a death screen. is like should we do that at this point should we use this craft at this point probably if we want to not miss the chat chance to see it hey I'm not even in range this will go with a cure again Kevin back in the game, you know. Now we will. Definitely. Who needs it more? You. As clouds fall, Sakura bloom. Fallen warriors gather in the evening room. And I present you your doom. Sakura morning moon! Monado symbols there, you know. Um, let's see here. Let's go over simple um, dark matter. Job done. Enjoy the show. That was alright. A level up. Oh. I expected no less from you, Richard. If a knight of the Grails were on your side, my loss was likely guaranteed from the start. Not at all. Breaking through your defensive formation was a real challenge. It's clear you've already surpassed me as a commander. Oh, hardly. I've still got a long way to go before I can say that with confidence. And while I wouldn't ordinarily tell you as much, won't waste this chance fate has granted me. I still deeply regret that you decided to leave the army behind, Richard. <laughs> That was how I felt about Brigadier General Bright. I'm sure you remember where that led me. Our paths are parted, but we both inherited at least part of him. I have the path of the sword, and you have the path of the soldier. Well, they may differ. We can both work towards the same goal. <laughs> right, I suppose. Take this. Ooh. Lieutenant Colonel Sid handed Richard the barracks key. Key to the barracks? As it seems you're aware, I am but the first of several opponents you will face here. You'll want to prepare yourselves. The worst is still yet to come. Father Graham, please do all that you can to lead everyone trapped in this world safely back out of it. I have a feeling you're the only one who can. Leave it to me. I will. Yeah. He's the very model of a soldier. Well, we should move on. He's shown us the path forward. We shouldn't let his goodwill go to waste. Got it. After the barracks we go then. The door is locked. What's in here? This is Lyston Fortress's first barracks. We should be able to open it using the key we received from the Lieutenant Colonel. Good call. Let's give it a shot then. Kevin used the key to unlock the door. This is only one of many such barracks in the fortress. So it's not all that large inside. We shouldn't need to spend too long in here. Got it. 
No one at the counter. How incredibly rude. Horse flag. Isn't it convenient that you always find weapons that someone in your group specializes in? Uh, you're welcome, by the way. Yeah, it's odd we don't get like other weapons. What other types of weapons are there that we could get? The door is locked. <gasps> My god. What do we do in that case? Unlock it. Hello, Bob. There's some green hair inside. The chest prays to Adios, this sinful priest gets his just desserts. No, it's just a guy. I was like, what's in there? Oh, it's just a guy. It's just a guy. Monsters appeared! So what we got here, then. Attack it open, we know about you. Bloody Sabre! A wild war monster that wanders in such a bland. Recovers by a draining prey. Fuck up EX. On Mr. Richard. Fuck up EX on yourself. And you begin your usual spam of your true luminous stuff. <laughs> Death scream. Although, hmm. It should be obvious why. I call this I mean, it should be obvious why. I'm not going to explain why I just did that. It should be obvious. Take that. And there's Napalm. There's Napalm. There we go. Yes, out of range. Let's go with the death screams. That's simple enough then. What is next? Some pep hair. B01 key. What if the world you live in is actually a gigantic chest? And we await the day of the coming of the one who will open us. It's coming. Unless the door is locked. Well, that's ominous. I don't feel like that's the correct... Hello? Just a random guy. This has to be the way, right? I've been waiting for you, Your Excellency. What? So our next opponent is you, Kanon. What a tragedy it is that we should be forced to meet under these circumstances. What did I ever do to deserve turning my blade against the man I have always duly served? But please never doubt, even for a second, that I am doing this against my will. I would never even dream of fighting you if I had a choice. I understand perfectly well, Kanon. But if I may, I would rather you stopped calling me Your Excellency. It was never a fitting title for a mere colonel to begin with, and now I don't even have that. I would rather you simply call me Sir, like you usually do in the office. I have grown very fond of it. Your Excellency, I'm sorry. Just while we're here, please let me call you the way I'd like to. The Canon Amalthea, who stands before you, is a symbol of my failure to truly move forward from the past. And something tells me that if this symbol were to defeated by you, it will finally allow me to put the past where it belongs and be born anew. No. Very well. In that case, do as you will. And I'll be damned. Maybe she's actually got a likable, respectable side after all. You don't have to sound so surprised. Well, Your Excellency, I have no intention of holding back, so you're ready to begin. At any time. Hmm. Let's at least buff up. Funny this time before we test the waters. Ah! 
Mm, La Forte. Let's go with a clock down there. The guy is shield. I think very much get get yeah get Kraus fit out now. This 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 is why I prefer this S craft over his other one, because yeah. I mean, do we have like three three opportunities now? Entirely possible. Um, what can you do here? Probably best to get that out on you. Mines all over the place. All right, so I'm thinking, 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 Hard hitters, they're very hard hitters. <laughs> hmm. I know it's 195, but it's just that like if I can just push them back, just give myself some breathing room. Just something. This is the problem, I'm like, yeah, I could spam this. But each time he's gonna be poisoned, so. It's just that case of like I need to, I need to ensure I survive. Hmm. Survival is so important right now, really. So that's, that is the issue. That is the massive issue with this. It's like I could I I need I need these buffs before all else, but I need the poison gone. I really should focus on getting the poison gone. Can you fail? Alright, let's 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 recover from this. Because we can recover. It's just it means sacrificing people first. Can you not reach him? Okay. Alright, so You're being sacrificed for the greater good. I should have got rid of that poison. That, that's, that's what threw me off. I should have got rid of the poison earlier. Should have been my focus, shouldn't it? A foolish decision. A foolish decision. Right, so, clock up EX. On you. Thinking the potential of having poison come away again. I need to ensure that's resolved. And I'm thinking, just get these clock ops going like crazy. Who needs some more clock ops? Just thinking, maybe... Just play it a bit more safer. So I am basing it around the previous fight, which is like, hmm, a bit more tougher, a bit more tougher. So, hmm... Who needs a clock up? You need a, who, who's it? Who am I casting clock ups on? I don't remember anymore. I'll just be sure. But mine's out. Okay. See there, the poison. Poison's the issue. Good, good, good. That should have been what I did last time. Okay, we might lose Richard there. That's fine. Oh my god, there's just so many of them! Take that. I just need my chance to get all my buffs out and everything. Like that, it's like, calm down! Give me a moment! Just a... just, just a moment! Hey, Jabus! Get... Just give me breathing room. I mean, he's not in range. Hmm. Kind of need him to be up back to normal, but at the same time, you know, actually be able to do stuff. Oh, 
got anything there. Okay, I think try and play it safe. Okay, so we've got everything coming around our way that we want. Get Richard up now. Oh, for God's sake. That would have been perfect. That would have been perfect. Fine, fine. See if I care. I mean, I do, but. Hmm. So, what do I want with Lace? Battle Dance, probably not a good idea at the moment. Okay, Richard. I mean, I know you've got your crit. But I think staying alive, probably more important. Probably. Okay. So everyone's up. Let's pluck a BX. Guy shield. I mean, I know Kevin needs a heal, but just hoping everything like he can do that himself now. Okay, he can look after himself. He's a big boy. He can look after himself. Okay, so La Forte. I only really want it on you, Richard. So get yeah, like a someone else at the same time. That's fine. Okay. Lock down. I just, 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 just get like put it on you two because you're the closest to those two, and I feel you two are the more important of the bunch here at the moment. And there's the issue. So it's the amount of people. I just need that opening. If everyone's still alive. It's an, uh, can I not get closer to him? Mm. Like, stop hitting him! Like, yeah, we're getting that, that's great, but... Stop... Killing... Oh, for God's sake, Annalise, I need to get you a range up, I really do. Let's, 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 let's... Okay, reviving. We'll get him up eventually, we will. He'll stay alive. He will, eventually. Okay. Right. Clock down, please. Hmm. So many attacks with the AT delays, just stop it. Stop it, guys, you. Right. <laughs> Who needs to heal most? Ah, you three. Probably yourself, at least. Should you do the poison at this point? Like, ah, poison. How dare you. How about I dare you? Alright, so, uh... Ooh. Just get, get this, get this controlled. And yeah, we got you left, but... Right. <sighs> okay. Let's make sure we stay alive, yeah? Everyone is definitely speeded, speeded down. Let's try and get some of these guys dead. Um, death screen. We 
for God's sake. And maybe I should have gone on the defensive a bit quicker. On the attack, I mean. Because I probably would have ended some of this stuff much quicker. Had I done that. But the fact these guys are dying fast, that's what I should have done. That's what I should have done. And look how fast they're actually dying. Well, I meant move attack, but alright. We'll get you, Olivia, on the way past, don't worry. We're on our way. Don't you worry. Let's see here. I don't know, Thelus. Can I even reach from here? Nope. Oh god, your movement is terrible. I'm back, baby. Just be careful. Because I feel he deserves it. That could have gone much better. Goddamn 80 delay. Nah, that was terrible, mate. <laughs> I knew I wouldn't stand a chance against you, Your Excellency. The rest of you fought passably as well, I suppose. Passably was probably accurate. <laughs> Thanks. Hmm. All of you should make sure you don't get in His Excellency's way in the battles ahead. You'll be facing the strongest warriors in the Burl. Doesn't need you stopping him from fighting at his best. Way ahead of you. No, seems there's still something important left for me to do, after all. Oh well, I believe that by clearing the trials ahead, I will finally be able to do it. It's thanks to you that I feel ready enough to face those trials head-on. So, thank you. You don't have to thank me. I don't think anything more I could say for you right now. All, I, all I'll do is pray that you safely overcome the trials before you, and return to the real world unharmed. Thank you. I will. Triple dot. Anyway, let's shuffle onto the heart of the fortress. That's the key to the command center, right? That's correct. It's the building directly in front of you when you enter the main courtyard from the entrance. This key should allow us to gain access to it. And we'll be doing that at the start of the next part. Ta-ta for now.